Vincenzo's Crash Crypto Investing as we march our way towards uh, 16,669 2022 target. I've been telling you on our way to 1,000 subscribers that the crypto sphere was going to collapse. And you can see we'll start right off with the Bitcoin. I mean, I've been emphasizing this for months and months. And you guys got sick of hearing it. And I just had to keep telling you. And, and we're going to go back over this real briefly. I mean, you can see what's happening here. And we diagnosed, sniffed out, detected, overted, and so overted this. You can see we had a rising wedge up here. Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing started making videos here. And we told you why this was going to roll all the way down to these technical targets. And then we gave an idea where it could bounce. But up here, we told you this little round. Remember back here, watch some videos from the 24th of October or, or more like here, the 3rd, 4th of November. We said we got a little rounding bottom. Come back up and back test this for one more time. Get rejected. And then this would be the critical area. If you failed it, you're, full, you're collapsing Floop, right back down to this orange ring. That was going to be major support at first. Then as soon as it dipped below it, that's when the game was on that told you big falls were ahead. And we've been having these targets. Even when this price was moving up, we predicted it to go lower. We thought it would top out right here on its way up to make a nice double top. Instead, it made it all jabroni enticing mountain double top, which is a classic setup. Then we've been watching it dance on here since December 6th for about two months. And we told you it was going to eventually break this orange ring and then trade down. And your first target was... 37,000, then 33,000, then 28,000. But what we thought we were going to do here, as we back that up a little bit, was form a symmetrical triangle where we had your overhead resistance descending or falling with your orange ring and then your underneath support, the bottom of this white support box. And that would be the duck's beak. And that would be your, uh, your descending triangle. And that's where we thought we'd be traded in. And then it would look something like that because it's making the full lateral flush down first. And then you just trade up and down like this. And then you make your next flush down. This is what I think you're doing right now. Because once you make that flush, your targeted move is all the way down here at $18,969. And this is where I think you're going the next three to six months. I've been telling you since way, way back here, once this broke the uptrend, you were going to be in a multi-year bear market. And you guys, all three here kept asking me, is the, is the bear market over? Is the bear market over? Is the bear market over? No, this is going to be a long-standing few-year bear market. And it started in May of 2021. So May of 2022 to May of 2023 is going to be consistently down. We have this huge pump up here, but it's overall now going to be consistently down after this massive pump here right just to just to cap off a massive double top right there the mountain double top aren't seen that much but when they are seen they are spectacular the way they play out right and that's what's going on here and that's what's going to continue to go on in the crypto sphere and we're trying to keep you out ahead of it right so that's that's what it's looking like in the bitcoin and the xrp you can see the symmetrical triangle now we're breaking it and we went over this extensively, what was going on in here. And you can see your technical target out of this symmetrical triangle as we just clean it up a little bit. Get some of this bullshit out of there. You can see the technical target is all the way down there at 23 cents on that green ring, right? See that down there? And right now we're breaching and we have breached with some nice volume. Not a lot of volume, but a lot more volume than there's been in the recent past so that confirms the breakout right or the breakdown in this case and you can see your next target now if you can't hold this double bottom support from that flash wick your next support is all the way down here at 48 cents right get that out of here all the way down here at 48 cents and then your next target is way down there we're gonna, we don't need this on there. Get rid of that. It's way down there at 20 cents. So it looks like you flush this and your next target is 48 cents. And we've been out ahead of this in XRP better than anybody in the ball game. And this is where you're going. We've been diagnosing, sniffing out and overting and subverting uh, the criminal gangster cartel. 
And if remember when we zoom out, and that's why we always start from the far out time frame and then work our way in for a super simple, easy analysis. Because if you take a look back here, what we had going on is you had uh, descending overhead resistance, $1.69, $1.37, 102, 56, 76. This is a neutral continuation pattern, and that was your upside target. But we thought it was going down, and 23 cents is your downside target. But I think you're coming down to 48 cents if you can't hold the 72 cent ring, right? So if you can hold the 72 cent ring, you do something like this, back test it and flush. If you can't hold this, you dance, dance, dance and flush, right? But it's very bearish and I think you're coming to the 48 cents in the XRP. Like, subscribe and share to Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing. And we're gonna keep you out ahead of the competition to sidestep and audible the criminal gangster cartel uh, and the market manipulators, right? And then we're gonna quickly end with XLM. And this is breaking the symmetrical triangle too. And it has flushed with great volume. And we dare, we are about to hit that 22 cent ring. We just hit it early. So it would actually be down here at about 19 cents. And on the full lateral flush, you're coming all the way down <clears throat> to that 11 cent target that we had circled. And that is your targeted move from that symmetrical triangle up here. Uh, that's what's going on. We'll give you more updates a little bit later on tonight as the market continues to crash. Peace and love, peace and love.